Have you ever been struck by Cupid's arrow? Or have you wondered what makes two people fall in love? From Shakespearean sonnets to contemporary love songs, the subject of love has captivated the hearts and minds of people for centuries. But what is love, really? Is it just a feeling, or is there something more behind it? Let's dive into the science and biology behind love and uncover the complex interplay of biology, psychology, and emotions that drive us to love. While science and psychology have not yet discovered the purpose of love, it has been discovered that love, desire, and attachments are strongly driven by our brain and biological mechanisms. This means that love is in our DNA. Despite the romance and magic we associate with it, it is actually the result of complex calculations by our brain and influenced heavily by our biology. A person's physical appearance is a factor. The eye helps our brain determine if an individual is a good match based on signs of fertility and health, such as healthy skin, youth, symmetry, and specific ratios between facial features. If we like what we see, we move closer to gather more information. However, there is something even more important than physical appearance, odor. Our nose is capable of picking up physical and genetic information about a person, not just perfumes. Studies have shown that men tend to find women's odor more attractive during her pre-ovulatory phase, and this is mirrored for women. In short, the pre-ovulatory phase creates mutual attraction for all genders. Other information, such as MHC molecules, is also important. MHC molecules are a core part of the adaptive immune system and fight different diseases, so it is important to have a mix of types. Women, in particular, use smell to identify partners with suitable MHC molecules, choosing only males with the correct mix of immune genes that are critical for the survival of future offspring. Kissing is one of the most romantic stages in a relationship. Biologically, it is just an exchange of tactile and chemical cues. All the magical feelings you experience from love are the result of your brain's activity. The human brain supports falling in love and it is a part of the brain's reward system. When a potential partner passes all the tests and you fall in love, the activation in the ventral segmentation areas of the brain increases. This increases your heart rate, makes your palms sweat, and focuses your vision, causing your bloodstream to be flooded with feel-good hormones such as dopamine, oxytocin, and serotonin, making you happy, alert, excited, focused, and motivated to pursue and acquire rewards. These chemical substances function similarly to amphetamines and some other abused drugs. So it is not wrong to say that love can make you feel high in its own unique way. Interestingly, these changes can lead to decreased activity in brain regions associated with critical thinking, decision-making and social judgment. This may explain why people in love can be blind to their partner's faults and make impulsive decisions. In conclusion, love may be a complex interplay between our biology, brain and emotions, but it remains a beautiful and magical experience. From the way we are attracted to certain individuals to the rush of feel-good hormones that flood our bodies when we fall in love, everything is a reminder that life is not just about calculations, but also about emotions, feelings and connections. Let us embrace the mystery and beauty of love and never stop being inspired by its power to create, dream and hope.